Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you are doing well. With me is a question coming from 2017 GCE paper one, question number two. The question reads, factorize completely x squared over 4y squared minus 1 over 9. Well, the task here is to factorize. Now, when we are given a question to do with factorization, the first thing that should come into your mind is to identify the type of factorization that you are dealing with. Remember we have what we call common factorization. We have a difference of two squares, that's the second one. The third one we have quadratic factorization. We also have factorization by grouping. So you need to know the type that you are dealing with. Difference of two squares, we always have two terms. Okay, difference of two squares, we always have two terms, meaning this is the term, one and two. Okay, so if you are given two terms, and those two terms must have a subtraction symbol in between, then you conclude to say this is difference of two squares. Always there will be a minus. You will never find a plus here. As, uh, multiplication or division always minus then you say okay this is the difference of two squares the other one is quadratic factorization quadratic factorization we have three terms and it looks like this I'm just giving you an example we can say we have 2x squared minus 4x plus 6 have you seen then when they say factorize this, just know that, oh, I'm dealing with the quadratic factorization. One, two, three terms. We also have factorization by grouping. At that one, we have four terms. So uh, probably they can say you factorize something like this, AB squared um, plus AB uh, minus 2CD, uh, uh, then plus 4CD, such kind of questions. So when they say you factorize this, just know that you are told to factorize by grouping, one, two, three, four. So that is what you need to know. Two terms, difference of two squares. Three terms, quadratic factorization. Four terms, factorization by grouping, okay? So what we have here, is difference of two squares and the moment you identify that this is difference of two squares this is what you need to do first of all we copy the question x squared over 4 y squared minus 1 over 9 difference of two squares meaning everything must be in square form that is the difference difference is coming from this symbol that's why I said that's why I said always there will always be what in? a minus in between here. Difference of two squares, everything must be in square form. But looking at the question that we have here, it's only x which is in square form and y. Is 4 in square form? No. What about 1? No. 9? No. Then your task is to express 4, 1 and 9 in square form. How are we going to write 4 in square form? Or how are we going to write 4 so that it carries a square? Well, we, the, the x squared, I will be able to copy the way it is because it's already, uh, already expressed in square form. The 4 here, I will be able to change this 4 to 2 squared. Have you seen? So that it carries a square. So you change the 4 to this. So where there is a 4, I'll write 2 squared. y is already squared, minus, what about 1? One? 1, I'll change it to 1 squared, which is 1 squared, over, what about 9? Nine? 9 will be changed to 3 squared. Have you seen? So I have 3 squared here. Now look at what I have here. Everything is in square form. What next? You now ignore all the squares. 
igno just write the bases so here you just write x over here you write the 2 here y minus here you write 1 over here you write 3 put this as the first bracket then the second one just to change the sign copy everything change the sign now you write x over 2y here now the sign will be plus 1 over 3 this is your final answer this is the way we factorize such kind of questions thank you very much for watching remember to follow me on facebook tiktok and subscribe on my youtube channel Thank you.